what's up guys welcome back to the channel today we are going through my journey of the front side and back side 180. so i would call this a tutorial but i'm not because i'm still learning how to do this but i still think that this could be helpful to you guys trying to learn because i get to show you guys what i'm struggling with and what i think i can do to fix mine by the way guys i want to know where you guys are coming from if you came from instagram or you just looked me up on youtube comment below that way i know let's hop right into it since i'm having a harder time with front side 180s we're gonna start with those first so one thing i've learned when practicing this is it would be a good idea to learn how to ride in the opposite stance since i'm regular i'm gonna learn how to ride in my goofy stance because when you're doing the 180s in your regular position you're gonna land facing the opposite way and it'll help you be able to control the land a little bit better if you practice that more comfortable when I lead with my pop foot. My back foot is going to swipe back and I'm going to rotate the way that the board goes. Same thing with both ways because if you try and lead with this one it's easier to take the front foot away from the back foot and then you lose control and your foot lands off the board. You also want to keep your shoulders nice and aligned with the board. You don't want to be over or behind because then that happens. So you want to practice with the form right over the board. That way your balance is right over the board when you use your shoulders to get that momentum. And then your legs follow. doing the front side you want to think of your body as a rubber band so I keep my position in that because when I jump up and ollie it's just gonna use that momentum to bring me forward you'll notice your board is rotating a lot more when you're doing the backside 180 now it's really easy to over rotate going backside so what I would work on more is getting a higher ollie and then that board will just move with you that way you don't lose control of the board so these are just a couple of things that I think help me out when I'm doing these. And I'm still learning, I'm no expert. I hope this helps you, and I hope you guys can nail these things. Let me know in the comments if these tutorials and this journey of mine is helping you in your journey. I'd love to hear what you guys think of these videos. Don't forget, Thursday we have a video coming out, straight jacket skateboarding, so stick around for that. We're gonna see you guys in the next video. Yeah, see ya.